Three bars. I'm uh, conducting the string sessions for this uh, project and um, it's been, we're, we're still mid uh, production or mid recording and so far it's been a very smooth and a pleasurable process. We have, how many strings do we have? Two, four, six, 14 strings, uh, six violins, uh, three violas and two, two cellos and it's a really compact but uh, flexible group. Kerry Dedman, as, uh, as you know, who's done all the orchestrations. Um, uses the strings in multiple uh, layerings and um, they're very flexible and very um, inventive so it's, it's fun for the players and fun for me to conduct. Often you'll find in this kind of music string players take a back seat and uh, have a very linear approach and Kerry makes them uh, come very much more alive so it's very fun uh, for us to involve underneath the brass which is the, the center of the sound. been constructing this is uh, Kerry has laid down the the rhythm section tracks with the brass and with Denise and now as a final uh, final layer we're, we're coming to add the string tracks so we have the opportunity to listen to the brass hear their phrasing and hear Denise's phrasing and then complement that uh, with the string so maybe we make might make small changes in the music to uh, to reflect what the people who've come before us have done so that's uh, that's a nice uh, kind of collaborative thing we can do, even though we're not in the same room as uh, the singer or the brand.
uh, are really fantastic. They're very, very inventive. And even though um, some of the tunes, you know, we're, we're recording standards here, he has a way of bringing a freshness and inventiveness to it. Um, he's a wonderful brass player, a trumpet and flugel horn player himself, and he really knows this big band style. And uh, his, string, his string writing too is, is really inventive, and he works closely with Michelle. So um, it, it's really a joy. Every project I've done with Kerry um, is unique and uh, d definitely challenging, but always fun and absolutely musical. Longer notes at the end are a great improvement. Thanks, Colin. And do you really want it to the downbeat, or is it the last eighth note of the previous?